everybody and welcome to another video. In this video it's going to be my Air Tycoon 4 series. Now last time I can... oh yeah I remember <laughs> we did set up those routes to Berlin and Gdansk but you know, like uh, like after that in the episode I really don't know what to do now. I haven't had like any suggestions for routes or anything, anything to put in. So uh, yeah uh, I can't, I can't uh, actually do that so uh, right, I just, uh, I'm just gonna ch I'm just gonna fast forward the term. <laughs> I don't know why. Uh, we can just like see our profits and the amount of money we have. Well, I know the amount of money we have and everything. Uh, like the amount of passengers we have are dropping away and cargo and stuff and blimey, going down a bit. Never mind. So, uh, what's in the news at the moment? Uh, if it like to load, that would help. Uh, oh great, that's why I lost a load of passengers, there's uh, heavy snow in London, which is where all my flights are going from, and Washington, and uh, there's actually a flight that goes from London to Washington, <laughs> so yeah, that'll work, um, right, uh, what was I looking, oh, I remember last episode I was looking at, um, because I was going to say, do we need to phase out any of our planes, and then I realised that we did check them all last episode, and they had about uh, half their lifespan left on them, so, in fact, more than half their lifespan. They had about like twenty-three years or so, or something like that. They had more than that. And so, um, so that was good. I just want to show you the A three eighteen. It's just come out. Um, I don't know if I'll use this. Um, but uh, I hate that uh, you, you can't actually do a stopover route with this on Air Tycoon Four. Uh, no, it's the A three twenty. A three eighteen. Can you see that has 3,500 mile range? Um, uh, that's actually more than, um, oh, <laughs> I thought it was more. Uh, with the AC-18, apparently, um, that's, ex that's meant to be more, apparently. And um, there's, a, uh, there's a route that British Airways do. It goes from London City Airport, not London Heathrow, to uh, Shannon. Oh, that's where it stops off to refuel. And then it goes on to New York, so... Um, if I could do that, that'd be good, but I'm going on, unfortunately. Um, it'd probably say, oh no, there's not enough uh, miles or edge or something. Um, <laughs> yeah, shorter than 8,000, 8,078 miles, which is a bugger. Never mind. <laughs> um, but that is the route that, uh, that is the route they do. Whoops. Um, <laughs> that's the route they do. Um, I don't really like setting up stopover routes because uh, you get the, you get barely any occupancy on them, meaning that you don't get much profit, which is a bad thing. So, oh my god, we're, no, we're only at 20 million profit, I think. <laughs> yeah, we're getting quite a bit of dropping profits, and then it'll probably shoot back up. Um, once we uh, once our passengers start coming back and the snow goes away, then all the profits will probably go absolutely shooting up. Um, yeah, we're now at 16 million. I don't think we've been that since the early 60s, uh, which is uh, pretty bad. Um, well, not the early 60s, or since the 60s. We haven't been that soon. So, yeah, I'm just going to keep on fast-forwarding the turns. Um, uh, just because, um, just because, just because I've got nothing else to do. Ah, uh, yeah, here we are. Profit's going up now. Um, not much, but they're going up. So, uh, right, what's in the news? The East 175 is going to come out soon. Um, I think, uh, I, was, I was contemplating whether I should get that, uh, but, but no, because cause I was thinking about getting it for going around the, my British uh, routes, but, there's a, but I've already kind of built them up gradually, because before I had the TU-104, then I went to the 737-200, and then 737-300, then the A321-200, and gradually there's been more and more passengers, and a little bit, a little bit more and a little bit more faster. And uh, getting the E-175 will just be uh, dropping it back down another level, and whoops, I didn't mean to go to Canada. Um, yeah, so putting, it to, putting the E-175 on will drop it down. And by another uh, thing on the spectrum, I don't know <laughs> if that's what you call it. So, yeah, like last episode... Um, it's going to be a little bit shorter. Not much. Um, probably going to be roughly the same length of this episode, but um, it may be a little bit shorter. I don't know. Um, so 
Uh, should we set up a route? Um, we could. Uh, I'm trying to. Like I said, I don't. I don't want to uh, set up uh, any long haul routes. The only time I'll set up a long haul route if somebody suggests it. Um, uh, if uh, if I um, uh, if that happens, I will. But I just won't do it on my own. So. Um, like if I get no suggestions for it. So what plane should we get? I want to set up a new route, but I don't know what. Um, <laughs> I want it to be kind of, medi kind of medium range. So like somewhere going into Russia, sort of far away, if you get me. Um, hmm, what could we get? What's this plane here? No, not that. What's this plane? The IL-96. Blimey, that goes far and it's fast. Um, and carries a lot of people, I didn't mean to say that. Um, hmm. I don't know. Uh, 204. Oh no, I wasn't going to get that, was I? Um, well, that's kind of a bit like the 757, I guess. Uh, Dash 8? No, not really. What do the CRJ 900s do? Hmm, you do 90 passengers. If you were doing a really, like, really short haul airline, I would probably. Uh, like get all these planes that carry like less than a hundred people. Um, they seem they seem to be uh, something I do. Um, <laughs> with Concorde, what you could do if you wanted a uh, um, so much satisfaction with barely any people um, on the plane, what you could do you could just uh, put the inches up really far. <laughs> well, I've only got um, thirty nine inches on there and I've got eighty six planes. Or you could just put it down right here and get the satisfaction really low. But, it's, yeah, it's 120 people, so I'm not going to do that. Um, I don't know why I tried to do that, to be honest. Um, yeah, like I said, the Concord will go out of production soon, so I'm not going to be using that, I don't think. I'm not going to be setting up any more stuff on the cargo routes, because, uh, yeah, like I said, um, uh, I want to I wanna, uh, get rid of that uh, the second the planes need, f they need to be phased out on that. So, yeah, that's what will happen with those. Um... 767, maybe. 767 is uh, kind of medium to long range, and uh, oh no, it's got like 7,000 miles. <laughs> That's always wrong. Uh, how much does the 777 have? No one of the variants goes really far. Um, it's a 300. Uh, but that's like really long haul travel, and uh, I don't really want that. So, uh, <laughs> I'm still contemplating on which plane to buy. I don't think they do the 717 in this. I think they should. They should uh, put the 717 in. Um, hmm. And I'm just flicking through planes doing nothing. Uh, nothing. Sorry. Um, hmm. I just want to see, um, which one was this one here? If I get the Dash 8 200 and try and get it on the uh, seats f as far apart as possible, that'd be really funny. <laughs> and you have, like, two people sitting on there or something, so put that up to full thing. And then you've only got 28 people sitting on here. Holy cow. Um, that is quite big. Um, that is huge. Uh, so. Um, I, I, I actually think I might get that. Just because I just want to make a silly little route. That would be really funny. Um, okay. Uh I don't know where this would go. This is probably going to be my silliest route of the game. This is going to be carrying like no people, is it? Uh, I won't put any fuselage. Um, I won't be putting like any fuselage coatings or anything on it. So um, if I just order that, uh, I'll probably set that up and then I'll end out the episode here because uh, I can hear my dad. Uh, <laughs> I can hear my dad outside um, uh, telling Dulu that um, she needs to. Needs to start coming off, which I will need to do the same uh, ASAP. So I'll try and finish this as quickly as possible. Um, so hmm, where could I go? I'll go to Amsterdam. Um, <laughs> I don't know why I used it. I, I'm not. I don't know why I'm using this plane, but it doesn't really matter. Um, it's pretty funny that I'm kind of using it. Oh well. So uh, yeah, I will just request. I'm guessing um, thirty slots here. I'm get uh, I I should think that'll be the maximum amount they could buy they could possibly do. Um uh, so we, I can just request uh, thirty of those slots and then I'll put in the route and end out the episode. Um so less slots here, here and here. 
And I know that the episode's only just been uh, about 10 minutes long, but yeah, like I said, um, um, it kind of misjudged the time a little bit, um, like I did yesterday, sorry about that. Um, but yeah, I kind of, um, I kind of, I, I had some homework first, and um, my, um, I've been ill again, <laughs> but it's not a, like, um, like sick ill, it's just my, uh, my, my digestive system's been going a bit flip. Um, <laughs> do we know what I mean by that? Uh, yeah. Um, that's just what's been happening, so it's uh, a little bit, a little bit, um, yeah, at the moment, so. Um, oh god, I don't need that many. Um, my digestive system's are kind of, uh, I've had something to eat, and it's like, it's kind of going a bit, eh, are we alright or are we not, sort of attitude, um, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, well, I do know, but I don't know if you uh, if you understand me. You probably don't, right? I don't need to be clicked on Heath floor. Um, well, I kind of do actually. Yes, I do. Oh well, I clicked off it anyway. It doesn't matter. So um, no, Concord won't be produced anymore. Well. Look at that. Concord won't be produced. Uh, November two thousand and three. That was the last flight. <laughs> Oh well, never mind. So, um, right, that's my dash eight two hundred. I can't believe I'm doing this. this. Is quite funny. Um, oh no, I didn't get rid of that alarm. There we are. Um, <laughs> oh dear. Right, let's um, let's put in the slot. Oh, this will be um, <laughs> this will be quite weird. Look how small this plane is. So scrawny. Got twenty eight people. Eighty six percent. It goes. Magnoi 4 4! This thing's so slow! So then I won't do 30 slots. Really? 29? You gotta be kidding me. Uh, <laughs> I did say it'd be around 30, so that was good. Uh, so if I can do duty free, um, like so. I can do a newspaper and a kid's gift, and I'll do a um, vegetarian meal and a. Um, um, I can hear Dulu recording next door. Bye, guys. <laughs> you just said. Um, <laughs> don't know why I mentioned that. Uh, so we're uh, right. <laughs> Set out that room now. <laughs> I was kind of, I was kind of planning one, wanting to go once, uh, blah, 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 wanting to do one to Amsterdam. Um, but I just wanted to. Uh, but I just wanted to kind of leave uh, the other room. I want to just set those up first because um, I wanted to set those up first because. Uh, yeah, this wasn't a really a route that needed to be uh, to be done, and um, and uh, I could have just left it, which I did do. So I'm just going to uh, I'll probably fast forward into into 2004, and then uh, I'll save the game and wind out the episode here. So yeah, like I said, it's a little bit shorter than usual. I'm trying to talk over <laughs> um, uh, the people outside because they're not actually being quiet. Um, so. I'll just keep on trying to talk over them so you won't have to hear them uh, that much. Uh, right, there's um, Olympics in Athens, uh, which actually happened. Uh, <laughs> I'm starting to remember kind of the stuff that's happening with the Olympics. Yeah, because it's, uh, Rio, it's Rio's Olympics this year, isn't it? God, the time's flying by, right. We're now in 2004. So, uh, right, I can, I can just save the game and I'll end out the episode. Um, I'm just going to move... Um, I'm just going to move my tablet while I... Uh, do the outro. <laughs> I don't usually do that in episode. Um, so if I just save it, uh, we've gone forward exactly one year because uh, before we uh, before we went past, uh, we were at uh, January two thousand three, and now at January two thousand four. So yeah, thank you very much for watching, and thank you for taking time out of your day to tune to my channel. I click on this video, and hopefully you watched it to its full length. Hope you did. Like I said, sorry about people outside. They still they still won't be quiet. I'm trying to talk to them to try and make them get the hint, but they're kind of not. Oh, well, I was talking over to you anyway, and uh, my microphone, my microphone and my tablet amplifies my voice quite loud, so, yeah, that's, uh, <laughs> so at least uh, I can do that easy. So, again, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video if you decide to choose that one as well. Bye!